hello everyone in this tutorial I am going to teach you how to install PHP travels on your website we have only six steps to do this task so let's start first of all what we have to do is just log into your client area from php travels.org enter your email id and password and log into your account once you log it in click on services inactive and then click on details on the product which you about of course the web application click on view details and right here you will see all the versions of php travels always we have to follow that we should download the latest version right now we have v5.0 this is latest version click on download and let it download on your desktop once you downloaded the package of php travels latest version move to your cpanel of your website this is my website reservation.com where i am going to install php travels and of course everyone is familiar with cpanel so just log into your cpanel and click on file manager so right now we have no files here just click on upload and select the php version which you have downloaded which may take few seconds to just upload the complete package okay so we have uploaded php travels to our website click reload and it will show you it is 31.0 46 megabyte click on extract and right now I can see all files as been extracted moving to your website type your domain name slash install all right so we can see the installation has begun click on next make sure all these buttons are in green color otherwise you have to contact your hosting provider in order to fix any issues if you found here after you fixing any issue and getting all these green green just click on next okay so third step is database entry now we have to create database uh, login again to your cpanel and here you can see my sql wizard click on that type your database name i am going to name it php travels click on next type the username i am going to use root and the password again php travels you may put your password or generate from there that will be best for security reason create the user and database click on all privileges go to next step right now we have created our database and username host name should be localhost database should be database name and username should be the username which we have created a few seconds ago and password where php travels all right click on next and give it a few seconds to import the database and it will take you to step four for license check Alright, so right now we have to paste 
our data uh, sorry our license which we have bought you may use your license look at it here or the same license is located on another location click on service inactive and copy the license I have many licenses. you just use the one you want to use okay type the license or paste it and click next so we are right now on the final step of installation right now here we have to type the admin name admin email admin password and have domain name and have your business name I'm going to type reservation because this is my domain name and here powered by reserve uh, sorry all rights reserved by reservation and click on next all right so right now we have installed php travel successfully we will see this message click on home page to confirm that the website is working fine and php travels have been installed yes i can see it has been installed perfectly yes just want to confirm by clicking on hot else yes everything seems good after that i have to log in to my admin to confirm the admin so the admin credentials are the admin and php travels which i have used it when I set up PHP drivers and password is admin and password. Click sign in. And it has been signed in successfully. So it means everything is installed perfectly. Once you log it in, click on my profile check your name check your last name your email your password your country and address and submit it thank you for watching if you have any problem please submit ticket and let us know so that we can help you further thank you and have a good day